Today is officially the biggest day for online shopping in the lead up to Christmas. Hundreds of thousands of Australians are expected to hit the internet to buy up big. Here to tell us how to bag the best bargains is retail expert Joe Munro in Melbourne. Always lovely to see you, Joe. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Now, why is today said to be such a busy online shopping day? Well, it's the last chance, Dan's, to get all of your prezies ordered online and arrive before Christmas, particularly oh. overseas. So today will be the final day that people order their, their items overseas. Okay. Um, we've still got a couple, like we've got a, this week for some of the Aussie sellers, and of course Aussie sellers often will have express post options as well, but today will be a big day in the e-commerce space. Oh boy. There are some new apps that can help us find hidden discounts on our purchases. Joe, tell us about those. Well, there's some really great in-browser apps that make life really easy to get your savings. So there's one called Honey, and you can actually uh, you go to Honey, you connect it to your browser, it sits there in your browser. When you go to a site, that Honey offers discounts and collects coupons for you. Mm. When you're about to check out, it pulls the coupon savings in and applies it to your shopping cart. It works beautifully on things like Amazon, and, and so it's really the way of the future of making savings while you're shopping without having to think too much about it. I like that idea. Yeah, uh, you know, great. but I also like being in a store and sometimes you can haggle for a bargain. You can't do that online, can you? Oh, yes, you can. Haggle's oh, yes, probably can. a bit cheeky. Um, I like to have a bit of a, a negotiation gently with the online chat people. So if you go to a website and they've got a, a chat function, yeah. I will often contact the chat people. I'll, I'll put the items in my shopping cart and leave it sit there. And then I'll talk to them about an experience I've had in store or ask them for some advice. And then nicely, once I've built some rapport with them, I'll say, is there a coupon code or is there a, a, another discount I can apply? just to make sure I'm getting the best bargain or else I'll have to keep shopping around. While you've got it sitting in that shopping cart, the temptation is that they'll give you an extra 10% or so. So that works very well. I've had that happen with a very big brand store that doesn't discount and they gave me 10% off the item. Sweet. So Jo, you yeah. have another trick we can do on our computer or phone to make sure we get the best price. What is it? Well, the, uh, as I was saying, the, uh, there's some very clever e-commerce sites and they track what you're doing. So they put what's called cookies on your, uh, on your browser mm. and they can see how often you go to the site, if you're paying full price for things on their site and they can track all your behaviours. You may, may have noticed you've been shopping, say, on eBay and then you go to Facebook and that item you're looking at is following you around all the different sites yeah. you go to. That's about the cookies. <laughs> and they keep handbag presenting handbag it to following you. Dave around, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Every time he opens up his phone... Anyway, He's got a hand there. Hopefully he's not watching. I love watching. that. <laughs> hey, so watching, that's what yeah. they do. So the cheeky thing to do is clear your cookies so they can't get your background and they don't know how often you shop or if you're a discount shopper. So often I will go to a website, or as I said, I'll put things in the shopping cart and I'll walk away. Now, if you've cleared your cookies, they don't know if you buy from them regularly and you pay full price or whether you're only going to be one chance dad so they'll oh, miss out on you. Yeah. So you walk away and then they often send you an email gotcha. saying we'd offer another discount you haven't checked out yet. Good Here's a, another incentive. So that's so, a cheeky way of doing it. Lucky I wasn't looking at lingerie for my wife. <laughs> 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 so I don't know how to clean my cookies. <laughs> now finally Joe, there are also some ways we can recoup money after we spend it. How do we do that? This is one of my favourites actually. I've been really giving this a test drive for Christmas, let me tell you. So uh, there's a company called Cash Rewards. You may have heard of them. They're at cashrewards.com.au. They offer cash back on your items and much like Honey, they are an in-browser app so you can download it, connect it to so I use Google Chrome. You can get onto Google Chrome. Uh, every time you just go to a, a store and you're shopping, it will come up and say that Cash Rewards have uh, a discount there. So you activate it and check out. So I was buying airfares a couple of weeks ago with Webjet. They popped up. I got a di another discount. So I, on the weekend, Dan Murphy's, I found some amazing wine, great price. Went to. I was going to go in store and buy it, but I bought it through activated cash rewards bought it not only did i get this crazy price for this one but i also get cash back in my account so a further discount even on discounted items and they're australian company right across the board with all your favorite brands so you'd be crazy not to if you're spending a lot of money this christmas this will help take the pain out of the credit card in january Absolutely. by uh, getting some extra cash back in your account good stuff joe and for more online shopping tips you can head to savvyshopaholic.com.au